I'm gonna show you how you can use Video Leap for free. Step one, you wanna to go to the App Store and type in Video Leap and then download Video Leap because this isn't gonna work very well if you don't have Video Leap. On to step two, you wanna open up Video Leap and you wanna go ahead and swipe past all the things they're showing you here at the beginning. Then down at the bottom, you're gonna see a little button that says dive right in. You wanna tap on that and then it's gonna open up what looks like an area where it's asking you to pay but you don't have to pay here. What I want you to do is look up in the top left hand corner and you're gonna see a little black X. Tap on that little black X, it's gonna ask you if they can send you notifications. That's entirely up to you. Once you make this selection, it's gonna drop you right into the Video Leap timeline. Now, before we go any further, I want you to look down at the bottom where the features are and I want you to look at Adjust and Tone Lab. You're gonna notice that they have a crown on both of those in a little circled color and it's a pinkish, orangish color. I don't even know what color that is. That indicates that these are premium features. As long as you're using Video Leap and you're not using any feature that has a mark like this or one of the ones that I'm gonna show you here in a moment, you can use the app for free. Now, let me show you how to identify some more of those premium features once you load some content into the timeline. To add content into the Video Leap timeline, it's incredibly easy to do. All you need to do is tap on the plus icon here in the timeline. Then Video Leap is gonna ask you for some permissions, like if they can access your photos. And of course you wanna do that, well, and your videos, because if you don't do this, you can't actually pull those into the timeline. So go ahead and allow access to all photos. Then go in and find the video or videos that you wanna work with. I'm gonna choose this one, I'm gonna add it to project, and it's gonna import the video right to the timeline. Now we're gonna go back down to the features at the bottom, and you can go through each of these yourself to find out which one is a premium feature and which one isn't, but let's tap on Glitch, for example. If you tap on Glitch, you're gonna see that RGB and Pulsar, those are premium glitches. So you don't wanna use those, but all the others, you can use those in your video for free. Now, you need to go through all the features in Video Leap so you can figure out which ones are premium and which ones are not premium, and you'll be surprised to know that a lot of great features in here are totally free, and you can render out your video with no problem as well. And when it comes time to render out your video, all you have to do is go up to the top right-hand corner, tap on Export, and you can see if I crank this all the way up to 4K, I'm gonna drop this down to 24 frames per second because I'm just cinematic like that, and then I hit Save, Again, it's not asking me to upgrade or do anything like that. It is exporting in 4K for free, and there will not be a watermark on the footage that I'm exporting. 